The one line version would be you need to master class 11 and 12 maths and to dig deeper we need to have a look at the syllabus and I have already made a video on the syllabus of PGED SMA exam so you can check it out from the description box of this video. What we need to master is JE maths which is essentially a kind of class 11 and 12 maths. You need to get hold of a good JE maths book and again I have made a book suggestion video on a good JE maths book. You can check it out from the description box of this video again. NCRT textbooks are also going to be very helpful. You need to have a look at them as well. And after that, the most important part is the tomato. Tomato, it's not the tomato which you're thinking. Tomato means test of mathematics at the 10 plus 2 level. That book is published by IASI and it's specifically meant for entrance exams conducted by IASI. You definitely need to prepare from that book as well. Once you have gone through the syllabus of this exam, class 11, 12 maths, JE maths, whatever you may call it, then there is a 5% portion which is still left. So you have covered the 95 portion, the JE maths, but the 5% part is a bit kind of like an undergrad level maths, which is sequences, series and sets. Now, these things are not really covered in a rigorous way in class 11, 12 books or JE books. There are good books available on algebra which will have sequence series and sets. If you already know such a book, good for you. But if you want a video on a good book which can cover sequence series and sets for PGD SMA exam, do comment below. Now, once you have covered this entire spectrum, then you move on to the next stage. Now, this is an esoteric aspect of preparation for any exam. If you look at the previous year questions, you can make your own strategies. And that's the main USP of practicing previous year questions. Once you have covered the syllabus, you have seen the previous year questions, modulate your questions practice because mathematics largely is solving a lot of questions, practicing them, finding patterns. Now, once you understand that what are the question areas and how I am able to perform in those question areas, you need to modulate your preparation strategy rather the question solving strategy or approach so that you can master the things in a more nuanced way and that would essentially position you as a top candidate. Remember, PGD, SMA exam or any IASI exam for that matter has a very limited number of seats. So you have to think of yourself as the top 10 or top 20 people in India. And for that, you need to have a very detailed way of preparation. There is nothing called enough in this preparation. You have to keep practicing, practicing and practicing till the day of exam. And I have also made a lot of videos on other popular data science courses. You can check out those videos from description box, from here or by browsing the channel.